Hi, in this tutorial we're going to talk about if else statement in Rust language. But first make sure to subscribe to my channel. More subscribers means more quality videos on my channel. Also in the comment section you can put a comment or link on anything related with Rust language or programming in general. Now let's back to the topic. If else statement in Rust language is very similar to if else statement in C programming language or some similar programming language. Let's make an example. Let's make main function and inside it let's use if else statement. Let's say that we want to check if our variable x is a positive number or a negative number or maybe a zero. So with usage of if else statement we can say that if is greater than zero then for example we're going to print a text that this is a positive number and else if this number x is less than zero then we're going to print that this number is negative and finally if our number is neither greater than zero nor less than zero then it must be a zero so we're going to print that our number is a zero if it's not positive or negative number. Okay and uh, let's define our x variable. So uh, x variable is going to be 32 bits integer number. Let's assign to him a variable for example number 5. Okay now let's run our code. And here we can see a warning that show us the main difference between C programming language and Rust programming language and that is that we have unnecessary parentheses around if condition and also around else if condition uh, because in Rust programming language you don't need to use parentheses to surround your conditions. Okay, now let's run this code again. And now we're getting that our number 5 is a positive number. That's all in this video. So uh, you can see that if else statement is almost the same as in C programming language, but you don't need to use parentheses for your conditions. That's all in this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you in the next tutorial. Bye.